Hello there everyone and welcome back to Cosmic Redux and your host, Mr. United States of America and Cactus Jack Lover. But right now we are uh we well I guess we've invaded um the Dominican Republic and the game's kinda of really laggy at the moment, but that's alright. Um got some comments to go through as we invade Haiti, because everyone loves the Republic of Haiti, as we are trying to clear up a whole bunch of other things. Of course we're war the third international, I'll be honest, there's been a lot of time between this episode and the last one, so yeah. Um it's gonna be a little laggy. Oh look at the Austrian Empire too. Oh, go figure. Oh, the Republic of Czechoslovakia. Well, that's certainly one way to start a video. This is very weird. Good job, Czechoslovakia. Um, I guess we gotta get this. Okay. Oh, wow. I guess we are trying to raid, and the German Empire is doing quite well. But some comments, such as, I second the Huey Long comment. Actually, a Cosmic Redux Pelly or MacArthur playthrough would be pretty swell as well. Yeah, I think that'd be a lot of fun. Someone else says, What's this? A regular Mr. Mocha Lover video? About freaking time. Someone else says, American anti-imperialism has to do more with pragmatism to ensure American business could penetrate market of uh, post-colonialist countries. Someone else says, can you do a thousand-week like Russian Republic of Nevikov as president? Eventually, yeah. It's on the list, but it's not very high on the list currently because I don't have a lot of time at the time of this recording. Um, someone else says this, what is with this buggy event of the saudi Almani War? That's a very good question. I'm wondering that myself as well. Myself? I'm wondering that myself as well, so. Keeps firing. Someone else says, um, YouTube thinks that this is Europa Universalis. Huh. That's cool. Oh yeah, I guess we're doing really well in Brazil as well. Someone says, wasn't American Protestantism or Protestantism had some sort of beef with the Catholicism? And I think the answer to that, that answer is yes. Someone says, also is Cactus Jack supposed to be polit a politician from the Rust Belt region? I think if he were from the Sun Belt, he'd be best more in the Pacific or Southern regions. And someone else replied saying, it's the Texas Democrats, our timeline, so. And someone recommends we try the Deutsches Überreich Kaiser, Kaiser Redux uh, sub mod. Let's take a look at it. So we'll see. We'll definitely see. There's a lot of divisions down here. We don't have a lot of divisions, as you can tell, over here. Um, some of these guys are still fighting in Brazil. My God, Brazil is such a nation, such a nation. Of course, it is not when it's really laggy, but whatever. So as, as we can help out, take out the. Uh... Ooh, that's too sub. That sucks. So the dudes over here. I think it'll be worth it. So this is a very awkward Czechoslovakia, isn't it? Not. Oh, there goes hungry too. Oh, uh, welcome back. Carl, now you're the one who's been subjugated. Very awkward. Anything else here? Not bad, not bad. They want to attack us. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, we pretty much just have to wait for Brazil to die. So, other than that, I don't know. This campaign's not going to last that much longer, as you can tell. There's not really that much for us to do. I mean, we're currently doing it on the beaches. But the game is laggy, so that I want to see what else we can do about that on the beach. Wow, look at that lag. Um, we'll read through a couple pokes as well. I've read through all these before, so I probably won't read those again. Uh, I think I read this one before, so you want to read that one, please go right ahead. Uh, Lend lease, of course. Like I said, I can't remember what I read here before, so if you want to read these, please go right ahead. Lion and the Eagle, of course. Mediterranean ports. Uh, I don't think I read about Persian influence. Location of oil, Persia makes it rich in potential, means it must be brought into the on top for the safety of all that involved. As well as the European recovery program? Because why not? Europe may have been retaken by its proper government, but still suffers from the fallout of the wars and revolutions that took place there. We must fund our allies with grant and aid program that are put together by the general staff and our top political advisors so they may rebuild more smoothly. Well, everyone, as you can tell from this video, it's not very long. At this point, um, I just used Kant's command to go to war with Uruguay and might as well go to war with the Argentinian Free Territory because, well, why not? We can't have any Reds here, not in North or South America. Brazil did capitulate, and the Union of Britain did too, as well as the Communist of France, and so I gave some territory to uh, the French Republic. The Germans kind of deserve most of this. Maybe not all of it, maybe. You know, I was wrong about that. But in this timeline, whatever. Oscar the first. Robert the fourth with a nice little hat. And then we have got you as well. Um, the French are back in France, somewhat under Henri Moldequeu. The Bill um, I gave it, uh, Switzerland to Fran France. Uh, Italy. Um, it's very disgusting over here. These guys are still trying to fight the Russian state. It is what it is. Um, French Republic still okay down there. Um, other than that, Spanish Civil War is still going on. Other than that, not much else has been going on. Obviously, these guys can't do very much against us. You guys are fighting in hills and mountains, which is a terrible idea. My bad. Should not have sent you guys down here, but whatever. But yeah, these guys, they all need to die. Because, why not? And we're still we're doing a European recovery program, so. Other than that, we're just kind of hanging out. Probably in the campaign right there, just because, uh, I really don't want to invade Iran. The Raj is nice and all, but and I don't really feel like invading Japan. These guys are going to die anyway, so. Yeah, that's pretty much that. I think we've done well enough. And besides, we're done with pretty much anything else we really want to do. Social conservatism is ruling the country by a megaton. And, uh, yeah, there's really no way that they can stop us from being being us. 
We're with Cameroon. Losses. Still a lot of losses. 2,000 losses in South America. Montevideo will be ours very soon, which will be great. Great, great. Cool. Yeah, just taking a while to get through all this. That's all. Okay, guys, go there, and Montevideo will be ours. Thank you, Uruguay. Yummy, yummy. Keep going, guys. Argentina still has way too many men left. And we got plenty of political power to prove it. We need a port, that's fine. Build up in South America because they don't like building infrastructure. Cool. Yeah, keep sinking everything. Not bad. Ah. Beautiful. So it cannot compare to us. Navally, or just in general, militarily. So yeah, it's been a fun campaign. Um, yeah, it is what it is. Not bad. But that just means we move on to another campaign soon, too. Where do you guys like to go in? Concepcion del Uruguay? Well, Uruguay's over here. Well, it was over here. But now they're dead. 100,000 losses. Holy crap. We got 200,000 more men. 45 divisions. And there they go. They've gone to war with each other, which is not good. Um, yeah, you're probably going to lose all your territory down here. Czechoslovakia looks like it's got like two weights on each end and just a thin middle. Um, it's definitely not good to go to war with those guys yet. I mean, we could, but I'm busy with reds right now. we got to get rid of the reds. It's a little bit more pressing than anything else. So, yeah. I guess technically I didn't give you orders, so... Bahia Blanca. Uruguay? What's a Uruguay? I think you mean American. Between 1,000. I guess you guys here was a big old mistake. A big old mistake. Oh, oh, third Valkyrie. Oh, that's great. This time we'll win. Well, let them kill each other. Now we'll see what happens. Ooh. Oh, France was released. Well, they're on the offensive now. Francois the third. Oh, well. Yeah, look at that. Wow. Eurasian bloc. Kuban People's Republic. Dona Ejibun is left in Albania, which is very weird. Cairo Axis, of course. Turkey did lose. No problem, not bad. Not that at a time we can do it anyways. Any, any, I always forget to research guns sometimes, you know. Ah, good. You cut them off. You cut them off and cut them down. Puerto Madryn. Madryn? Madryn. Good, 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 good. Only 200,000 losses, is that all? Head down, head down. You go to Cordoba. Not Cordoba, Spain, but Argentina. Should be able to win there too. You guys done? No, you're not. Don't lie to us. Should give up relatively soon if we take out uh, Buenos Aires. Or maybe not. Or maybe I'm wrong. Oh, so that now that I'm completely right. They're very close. La Plata. Mar de Plata. I should really learn Spanish. De Estero. Santiago de Estero. Cordoba's ours, great. Didn't have us at all, though. La Pampa. Are we almost there? 
close. Ah. And there we go. We got him. Not bad. But yeah, I don't feel like doing World War Three. Not with this much lag. But yeah, North South, Amer North South American Alka too bad, except for this whole Suriname thing. But hey, you know, it was a very short video. I think we did okay in this campaign. We accomplished whatever, pretty much everything I wanted to accomplish. So if you enjoyed the video, though, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.